My name is Georg von Krog. Uh, I come from Norway, uh, Oslo, Norway. Uh, I am a professor of strategic management and innovation uh, here at ETH at the Department of Management, Technology and Economics. We try in our research and in our teaching to identify the factors that impact on the success or failure of firms within an industry. And in particular, we focus on innovation and technology and how that might explain or these factors might explain um, the performance of firms. I just came from a meeting right now with a student and a company where the issue is for the company to evaluate ideas that come from outside the boundaries of the company, from, say, different research institutes, from different research partners, from other companies that they're working together with, perhaps even from competitors. And there, are, there is a host of ideas that the company now has to select amongst. And the student is trying to help the company in a scientific, scientific manner to develop a framework whereby the company can identify the best ideas to work on within innovation. And eventually, perhaps some of these ideas will then become finalized pro uh, products. But the core issue is how to select uh, gems or diamonds amongst that huge amount of ideas and that enormous amount of information about possible technologies which are out there. Together with the student and the company, this particular company, we are working to set up a uh, framework for the company to select those ideas. One of the most important things to, to bring with you when you are doing a master thesis uh, at, at MTech in general is basically curiosity. You have to be a, a curious and interested person in something specific. And that specific has to, I think, combine technology, management and economics. So what does that mean? It means basically that you typically, or our students use their technology background, their skills, their uh, knowledge that they have developed in the bachelor studies. They use that to tackle management and business problems in very often also in real life, as the example that I just gave points to. Many of our students are also working on real-life uh, issues together with companies. Most of the students who graduate from, from MTech, they tend to go into to business. Um, here, they tend to start at a managerial level, interestingly enough. They tend to lead smaller teams, perhaps lead small departments, uh, they start to take up uh, functions, for example, in the business development department of a company, de dealing with important issues for the company. Uh, and some students who do the MTech Master get so inspired by entrepreneurial thinking and the whole sort of entrepreneurial mentality of ETH that they go on and set up their own companies.